Racist Twitter trolls piggyback on Star Wars trailer hype. The dark side. If you're hearing my voice right now, you must be on the internet. And if you're on the internet, you can't miss the buzz about Monday's freshly released trailer for the seventh Star Wars movie, The Force Awakens. But a rising tide of tweets lifts all boats, even the ones full of racist idiots. The hashtag boycott Star Wars 7 got a quick trending shot in the arm, and its progenitors posit that since the new Star Wars movie's protagonist is black and the movie's director is Jewish, ipso facto the film promotes white genocide. Although a casual perusal of the hashtag on Twitter will reveal that its popularity is mostly driven by people ridiculing the idea, Genevieve Koshy, writing for Vox, traced Boycott Star Wars 7 back to a pack of goose-stepping troglodytes who we shall not name. By tweeting incessantly, they were able to barnacle their hashtag onto the hull of the publicity behemoth that is a new Star Wars release. So instead of feeding the trolls, let's review some of the classier responses to this bit of internet filth. Dr. Robotnik points out the uncomfortable parallels between the boycott trolls and the galaxy's least socially conscious bartender. While Diane warns the boycotters they'll be missing out on some surprise California love. And of course there were memes, memes, and more memes. Now, if anybody still wants to talk about genocide in Star Wars, maybe you should start a petition to make December 18th Alderaan Remembrance Day, lest we ever forget the Death Star. Like this video? Don't forget to subscribe and follow us on Facebook, Google Plus, and Twitter.